Hey guys, what up? It's Goose TV here again today. Today I'm back with more Mad Mobile video on my channel. Now today's video, guys, we're gonna be doing something super fun. If you guys did not see my last video, I opened up a Centurion pack where you get 100 elite players and a bunch of those are super, super good elite players. Make sure to go check it out because that's what this whole entire video is based on. Basically, I'm going to be showcasing my team that is entirely made out of players pulled in that Centurion pack. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on my post notifications so you never miss any of my videos. I'm going to have a lot more stuff coming out, and you're definitely not going to want to miss it. But let's get right into the video. So real quick before we start, again, first, you guys have probably seen, if you haven't already, click on my channel real quick. I have new channel uh, banner and logo. Everything designed by me. I think the banner is just absolutely amazing. I think the logo turned out great. I just love it. It's awesome. Hope you guys enjoy it too. If you want to vote on it, if it's good or not, in your opinion at least, go to my channel, go to the community tab, and you will see it should be the second one because I'll probably post about this video. It says finally got rid of the Easter channel art, a completely redesigned logo and banner. How's the new art? Please let me know. So far, 311 votes, 79% say looks great, 21% say not feeling it. So um, make sure to go vote. Let me know how you like it. I think it turned out great um, and everything like that. Also, you probably noticed the new intro. A lot of people have been commenting lately about how I need to change the intro. It's getting old. So I did that. Let me know how it is. Maybe I can do a couple different copies. Maybe a couple different designs. Let me know which one is your favorite. Let me know if you want me to do that because I can definitely do that for the next few videos. But let's get right into what this video is about. So like I said, we opened the Centurion pack. If you guys haven't already seen that video, um, it's the video before this. It has almost like 10k views right now, which is awesome. Super excited to have that. Um... But yeah, so you get 100 elite players in the pack, and a lot of them are super, super good elite players. So I'm like, why not try to get the most out of just not opening that pack? Try to get as many, like, different kinds of videos. The next video you guys are going to see, I believe, is going to be seeing how many coins I get from it. But this video, while they're still uh, on my bench, I made an entire team around these Centurion player polls. Now, the team is a 92 overall. we got a 94 offense, 90 defense, 89 special. Let's go over each and every player, and then we'll play some head-to-head, -head, see how the team uh, can do. So, um, offense is, of course, the best, best one for sure. Only two base cards on this lineup, which is sick. We got a couple boosts from players. Um, yeah, so our best players, well, we got three of our best players on offense. We've got 99, Keenan Allen. Uh, King of the Gridiron. This is also a 99, but has a boost, plus two carry to line up. And then we also got uh, Alvin Kamara with minus four two game plans. King of the Gridiron. Three 99s right there. That's very solid. QB, Josh McCown. That's the best we pulled, but we did pull a couple other things. Uh, I believe we pulled Dan Marino, and I believe we pulled this Prescott. Um, Drew Brees. We pulled a bunch of good QBs, um, but of course, Josh McCown was the top QB. And then uh, tight end, Travis Kelsey. Man, the Carter is so nice. We also, I believe we also pulled this Kelsey. Or no, I don't think we did. Maybe we did. I don't know. But, um, yeah, so, that was that. And then, other wide receivers, we got 92 Brandon Cooks. I had a choice of putting Brandon Cooks or uh, Julio Jones in. But, as you can see, Brandon Cooks has much better stats than that Julio Jones. So, kept him in. We also pulled, like, Calvin Johnson, Jarvis Landry, a bunch of stuff like that. Um, then, Randy Moss, most feared. This card was one of the most rare cards in most feared uh, when that came out that was one of those limited time cards um that you could only pull in packs and almost nobody pulled them and he was barely up in the auction house and when when they were posted they went for like 99 million there's three of those there's tony gonzalez randy moss and one other i believe i don't remember who the other one is but we were able to pull him which is super super sick then offensive line we got taylor luan playoff edition Ryan Schrader, st stacked, center, we got a bunch of good centers, frozen flashback, Marquise Pouncey, we also had a choice of Alex Mack, I believe, um, but a bunch of good stuff there, and then, oh guards, not as good, we had to choose some bases here, TJ Lang, and Joel Batonio, so that is the offense, 94, now defense is a 90, unfortunately, uh, let's see how many bases, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, rather than the two on the offense linebackers we got a bunch of linebackers i think linebackers was the number one position like the most players that i got but i only got bases and the best one i caught was uh 89 justin houston um 
Then we got Derek Johnson, who I believe is an 85 as a middle linebacker. Then Nigel Bradham, I believe is an 84 and 83. Terrell Suggs, who's an 86. Um, safeties, we got base Reggie Nelson and Landon Collins, top 100. Then DNs, DNs and D tackles were actually very good. All pro Demarcus Lawrence. And then 90 Thanksgiving stuff, Jadavian Clowney. D tackles, very solid. 95, Steven Paya. Um, and 96, uh, King of the Gridiron, Flash Freeze, I think, maybe. I don't know. Um, Aaron Donald. Then our nickel and dime, we got Jason Verrett base and Tremaine Johnson base. And then our corners are pretty solid. 92, Legend Eric Allen. And then 106, Draft Mike Hughes. Very, very solid card right there. That was our best pull in the pack. Special teams, kicker's the only position we did not get. Um, unfortunately, that sucks. Matt Prater, we definitely could have gotten, but uh, I got him in a different pack, sort of like that. For my kick returner, we got 95 Pro Bowl Pero Cooper. Solid right there. Very, very solid pull. Uh, punter. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I don't think I pulled a punter either. So, um... Yeah, that's awkward. I was going to put a gold in to show... I forgot, we did not pull a punter. But we did pull a punt returner, Tyreek Hill. Uh, 91 Color Rush Master, which is very solid. I actually pulled another one in another pack. Um, that's a super rare card as well. So that is the team, guys. Um, I forgot to buy a gold punter to show. Like That would definitely lower the overall. But 92 for now. Very, very solid team. Really like how the team turned out. I thought it was much better than I thought it would be. So, um, but let's hop into a couple head-to-head -head games. This is probably going to be a little bit brutal. Um, I'm probably going to be playing people with like 100 overall because I've gotten up to a 103. That's probably who I'm going to be ending up playing. But let's get right into the game. Yep, that's what I thought. 105 offense, 102 defense. Probably not going to turn out too good, but we uh, we will see what we can do. We do have some uh, decent, you know, halfbacks and wide receivers and stuff. Let's hopefully, they have some speed. We can get a couple good plays in. But yeah, let me know if you guys have any other video ideas. Definitely, after I do the selling team video, I'm definitely going to need some ideas. So, definitely help me out. Let me know what, you know, what you guys want to see. Because I can do my best to try to create those videos for you guys. Um, helps me too, because I can get more videos out and everything like that. So, we can get a first down with Franco Harris, who's going to get the truck. Very solid. I put him as starter. I believe he was faster or the same speed as... Um, Alvin Kamara. I don't know. Probably, probably that's countered. That's not good. And let's do. Let's just chuck a Hail Mary up to Brandon Cooks. Or no, I don't know. Randy Moss. I want to check out Randy Moss. He does give one plus one speed to the team, I believe. So yeah, you can't catch that. It, it's going to be tough with, especially with this team. But let's check it up to M Moss again one more time, unless I get sacked, which I will, unfortunately. Um. But we'll do one more drive, and that's going to be it. Like I said, it's going to be hard to match up against a team that I actually can like do good against um, at this point. Um, but just want to do this team showcase. I thought it was a pretty cool idea, making a full team. If you guys want to see other theme teams, let me know some ideas, because I, I think that would be pretty cool to do some other theme teams. It may, you know, make me spend a little bit of coins, but I should be okay. I might be able to make some back and everything like that, so... Let's see, let's do another smash. That's not working out for me, though. No, that's an interception. Okay. He decided not to catch it, but we'll do another Hail Mary to Randy Moss. Let's see if he can catch it this time. Looks like he might have one-on-one. -on -one. This time, he can't catch it either. Jeez. What's up with everybody not catching the ball? All right, let's do a hitch to Travis Kelsey. Oh, I can't even get the ball off. Okay, yeah. This is just not going too good. Um... Like I said, it's it's just kind of screwed up because I have a 103 overall team no, normally. But I'm not sure if the next video you guys will see will be the coin, like selling them for coins. Because it'll, it'll probably take a while to sell a lot of these players. Um, there might be a few videos in between. It sucks they haven't been bringing out these weekly promos. They say every Wednesday, or they said every Wednesday until the release of Madden Overdrive. There's going to be a brand new promo. But that didn't happen. The last, what, two, three weeks? It's today's Wednesday, no promo, unfortunately. What I'm hoping is, well, not what I'm hoping, what I'm 100% guessing is next Wednesday, we'll be getting the July 4th promo. July 4th is two weeks from today. That's on a Wednesday. So I would think that's going to come, you know, 
maybe a week before. Since it's on a Wednesday, that'd be my guess. And then maybe the promo will last for another week. So maybe a two-week July 4th promo. That's always one of the best promos in the game for sure. Um, they always have a lot of fun stuff you can do. And um, I just really like the concept. It's always just a good promo. I don't know what it is. Um, they always have some great ideas, some great players, some great packs, everything like that. But that's just about it for this video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, make sure to like it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'm Goose TV, and I'm out. I'll see you guys later.